a waterproof Bluetooth speaker with a secret superpower. Let's check it out. Dave Taylor here with this. This is the Fosse Audio waterproof Bluetooth speaker and it's a full IPX7 waterproof device so you can drop it in the lake, it can fall or float in the pool and yes it floats so great fun. If it gets rained on, if there's a sudden deluge, no problem. This is going to just weather it just fine. Now as to the rest of your gear, that's another story. So some quick specs and then I'll give you a demo and then I'll show you that secret superpower. So 70 to 20,000 hertz frequency response, a 75 decibel signal to noise. So not a huge amount of bass as you would expect from a speaker this small, but actually pretty decent sound. 24 hour playback on a charge. You charge it. There is a little rubber panel that comes off. Not super easy to get off because it's pretty deeply in there. But once you open it up, then there is USB-C for charging. It includes a USB-C cable, no big surprise there, and a tiny little reset button if you need it. I certainly didn't. And that's really it. You charge it, you push this back in to make sure it's properly sealed, and you're good to go for 24 hours. Very nice. Now, it also features Bluetooth 5.0, which is the latest generation of Bluetooth. And where you can really see that is that it's very responsive. When you push a button on here, almost in instantaneously, it changes that on your source device. And in terms of those buttons, a little close up here, you can see power, volume down, volume up, pause play, and there's that triangle button. Now that one's pretty cool because the triangle button is a stereo mode. If you get two of these and you push that button, they'll pair and you'll only need one input signal and it'll automatically split that into a TWS, true wireless stereo, and you'll get better sound reproduction. So that's pretty cool. But of course, even with just a single one, and yes, it comes with the carabiner too, you can hook this to your backpack and rock out while you're on your next big um, backpacking expedition or something. So with that in mind, let's get some demos going. So first off, let's get some music and see if I can get to my music. Here we go. And I'll turn the volume up a little bit. And there's some bass in a second. You have to wait till the music gets there, but it will. What there isn't, there isn't a drop. This is not that kind of music. But you can hear, it actually does a pretty good job and it's pretty darn loud. I mean, it's a little bit bright as you would expect from a speaker this size. Let's just go ahead and pause that. Um, but it's entirely functional. There's nothing not to like about this. And it is very much a speaker of its size in terms of its music reproduction. It's mostly mid-range and a fair amount of highs because there's just not space and power to put in a big bass speaker to give you that really low frequency response. Kind of the nature of the beast. Now, having said that, I'm sure you're wondering, all right, well, what is that secret superpower? Turns out the secret superpower is it also has a microphone, so it also could be a speakerphone. So how does that work? Well, all you need is you need to have it actually work with something that's looking for audio input, like a phone call, like an audio recorder. So now you're hearing my voice as recorded by this device, and I can demonstrate that by just simply tapping on the device. And it's not bad. There's no mute button. It doesn't have four microphone pickup and 360 degree coverage or anything. But in a pinch, it's not a bad way to do a call or to otherwise interact with someone when mostly you're just listening to music. So let me get back to my regular mic. And that's really everything. But let's go back to the music. And while it's playing, let's actually drop it in water. And as you can see, it's floating, it's still playing, the top of the mic of the speaker is sitting on top of the water, all entirely functional. It's uh, <laughs> sort of a drip dry speaker there, and I'm going to just go ahead and put it on my trademark customized 
speaker dryer device, which also known as a towel. And that's really everything you need to know about it. Now, it is 4.3 inches by 1.5 inches by 10 ounces, so it's just about the same weight as your smartphone. I'm using an iPhone 14 Pro, so it's a smidge heavier. The front is a grill material and the back is a rubberized material with two little feet and ridges. And I assume the ridges are partially designed and partially to help with water. But either way, when you put it on a surface, it's not gonna wander around if you put it on super loud. And that's really everything I got. I really like it. I really like the sound reproduction for what it is. This is not an audiophile experience, but if I want to be, say, listening to some music on my boat and I don't want to worry that I might knock it over and have it go kerplunk into the lake or something, then this is great because it'll float. Now, if you have really dark water and you have a black speaker, that might be a little hard to find, but that's, up on, that's on you. That's not something the speaker needs to worry about. Um, and that's really all of it. So the only other thing that we need to talk about is the price. But before we get to the price and before I get all the water off my hands, I'm going to ask if you could subscribe to my channel. Really appreciate when you do that. Click to subscribe. Click to turn on that notification service with the little bell icon. If you found this useful and interesting, go ahead and give me a like or a thumbs up. All really appreciated. Excellent. Thank you. Now, this is the FOSI Audio Waterproof Bluetooth Speaker, and it is $29.99 at Amazon.com. Simple, straightforward, fully waterproof. It floats. It's going to give you lots of great music reproduction, 24 hours on a battery, and it has a secret microphone so you can even use it for phone calls. Definitely one worth checking out. That's all I got. I'm going to get back to my music, so I'll have to catch you in my next video.